Hello and a very warm welcome. My name is Andreas Goldman and today I would love to take you with me into a deeper perception of energy. You know, we are not only physical beings, we are also energy beings. If we look at the physical matter we are, we are actually using the normal physics to see that we are made out of atoms. But the moment we change into quantum physics, this moment we realize that we are pure energy, like a wave of energy. But in today's life, many people cannot feel this any longer. They are so distracted by all the information they do get from TV, from the internet, being disturbed by their phones, not being able to feel themselves any longer. So they don't realize that they are pure energy beings. And then there is another fraction of people that are so highly sensitive to energy that they feel threatened by almost every kind of wave that goes through, be it a Wi-Fi or electronic, electromagnetic fields. I'm sorry, sometimes I'm searching for the right words. Um, my German mind is not working in English the whole time, so please forgive me. Yeah, so there are electromagnetic waves that go through us the whole day. And some people are extremely hypersensitive to this kind of electromagnetic waves. And what we want to do today is that we balance out so that the people who do not feel this much energy any longer, and they don't feel that they are energy beings, get a deeper perception for themselves. And the other ones that are feeling too much energy and are actually distracted and feeling disturbed, even getting into a kind of feeling like being threatened the whole time and hmm, go into a perception of retreat and, and uh, yeah, you know, you close yourself out from life if you feel threatened by energy the whole time. That's quite disturbing because Mostly these people have a very high volume of uh, heavy metals in the body. And because of these heavy metals are stored in the cells and the whole tissues and everything, these metals start to vibrate because of the electromagnetic field that they are living in. At the moment they have more heavy metals in the body, the whole body is starting to shake. It's like a vibration that's the whole time on it. So I can highly recommend to you, if you experience this, please start to detox. Go to your really trusted doctor or naturopist, natu natural doctor. <laughs> you see, it's not that easy. And have a look so that they can help you to detox all these heavy metals out of your body. And you will realize it's getting less and less a problem, the electromagnetic fields you find yourself in. That's one thing. But first, let us get a feel for ourselves. How do we feel about energy? How is it in your life? Maybe you have a spiritual praxis. You do a certain kind of yoga every day or chi breathing or prana breathing every day, then you know all about energy. You have realized already that you can hire your chi, your hmm, main source energy in your body so that you can heal better, be more alert, be more awake, practice in a certain way that you maybe use a breathing technique that brings in 
the energy into your body. That's all good, but to actually feel it in a vibrational level, in a very soothing, calming way, is a very different thing. And that's what we want to do first. We want to soothe out for all the ones that experience stress and enhance the energy for the ones who do not feel this much. Okay, if you do not know about me, my name is again Andreas Goldman. I'm an intuitive and sound healer. I work in this field of work since more than 25 years and I accompanied hundreds of thousands of people so far to actually get into better health and yeah, live their life in a more joyous, happy way to open their hearts and really contribute who they are and what they are into the world, into life, so that we can all experience a much more beautiful life full of love, joy and abundance. That's what I do. And I use my voice box in a kind of shamanic old Celtic traditional way to actually represent a state of being. And through this state of being, your consciousness can connect to mine. And if it likes what I do, it actually grabs onto the vibrational profile. Again, we are all energy, all information. And then you start to shift into a different kind of consciousness and into a different kind of vibrational pattern. So before we start, I would love you to actually feel how you feel about your body right now. You can just stand up and walk around a bit or you just stay sitting and go into your feeling uh, of your body and, and how your tissues feel. How do your tissues feel? How open is your breath? And if you walk, how do your feet move on the floor if you walk and it's just feel how uh, stable you are in your structure how your thighs feel your calves your hip if you're sitting you can turn a little bit just check how tight your tissues and how tight your spine is how are your eyes if you look into life, into the world? Are they open or is there a restricted view? Is it work to open your eyes? Is it work for you to use your vision? Or is it easy to just look relaxed? Do we have focal vision or do we have a peripheral vision? It's also a big question. How do you feel in the space you find yourself? Are you just thrown into space like a, a person that is thrown into life and is steered from the outside like you're just part of life? Or do you realize that life exists and emanates through you? Do you realize that Everything you experience is extremely unique because it's your point of view. Depending how you have been raised, how you grew up, what kind of information did you get? You did get. <laughs> and what kind of emotions you experienced? So the moment you realize that all this creates a very unique experience that only you will experience, not your spouse, your friends, your children, your parents, only you. You realize that life as you experience it is a creation of your own and it gives you the possibility to change things. The moment you're thrown into life and other forces are forcing you to do something, then you cannot change things. 
you need to come into the different perspective. This is part of what we do here. So that you become the conscious creator of your life. So once you did all this, this check-in, I call it, just come back and sit down and relax with me. The best is you sit on the edge of a chair, have your legs straight on the floor. Upright, relaxed, check your breathing. How deep can you go into your belly? And let's open the space for change. Body and that toy, I need to go each. Elevates a man to not a evil little moon, the rich man and the balm Feel the space around yourself and realize how it's already soothing or raising the energy into a middle tone, we call this. In Germany we have a saying, it's called, muscle. If, you, if you contract a muscle and you contract it hard, this is a high tension. If you slack it totally, it's, it's low tension. And what we want to do is that we come into the middle, how you tune an instrument into the middle, so that you can go high or down, high or low. But it even the Krishna, it is non tol mohi dal mai. Mars dein on del del Emania Tore Sabajin Ki Our Sajan, Tolong, Tonere, Fui. Wak, Irina, Chal. Shaira, Wal.
வரிந்தாம் பண்டல் ஊ பாரிய படத்தல cells the feeling of expansion and also a feeling of joy and happiness that lays within bakare se sejit daranat an burdened nare sere unburdened sh re no pak ere beautiful thank you for being with me today and yeah i'm looking forward to the next time check area to the whole thank you